Recently off camera, I have been playing Halo Reach, and after completing all 12 missions, I share with you today if you should buy it for you or a friend. I'll break up into five parts because why not? Anyway, here we go. Number one, gameplay. Now, despite being made in 2010, it's not bad for its time. The graphics are decent, it's not buggy, and works pretty well. So yes, very cool. Number two, weapons. Bang, bang. Now this is where stuff gets big. There is an abundance of weapons, not just the ones from Halo Infinite, but some new Covenant and UNSC ones. Trust me, there are plenty to mess around with. Number three, price. Now, to get Halo Reach in your hand, it's gonna set you back. Drumroll, please. About £9, which is quite good for what you're getting, and when it's on sale, it's £2, so make sure to double check that. Number 4, Story. Now don't worry, I'm not going to spoil anything made here, but all I'm going to say here is it's a very good story with lots of fun and interactive missions you can play. Last but not least, Number 5, Is It Worth Playing? Now this will vary to you and me, but in my opinion, yes, definitely. As I said, the missions are very epic and very cool. Overall, the best game I've ever played, so I'm going to rate it a 10 out of 10. And the announcement is, do you want to see me play Halo 1 on camera? Well, subscribe if you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.